All right, this is the moment we've been waiting for. Four minutes to go. Can't wait to see how fast it's gonna go. Hey, we're in. I feel like I got a brand new machine. Two times in a row. All right, so you can see 5,500 and 21,500. All right, we still got very similar Geekbench results. All right, let's try out Simbench. And it's at 900. All right, previously, this would only get us an average of 13 frames a second. Right, in this test, I'm gonna see how fast I can get this project to build. getting close but so there you go it, it went really fast at the beginning and it went there then it started to drop and now it's around two all right it's done and it took 187 seconds We're done. 155. Five. That's fast. That's fast. They must have done the, the power limit fix. All right, we are in Windows because I want to find out what they've changed. Stability test. Okay, previously this would make this fella throttle. Let's see how it goes now. So straight away. There is a lot of throttling happening, so it looks like the fix is only for macOS and there needs to be new bootcamp drivers in order to get it to work on Windows.